Good Monday, this is Jay Brew, co-chairman of Seafried and Brew. Just came back from the Sheshnov CEO affiliation. Got to meet some of the fans of our weekly webcast, which is always a delight. But the thing that's great is going and speaking on a topic and having a banker add something in that then is something that I can reuse and portray to you in terms of the creativity of banking. And when we think of creative banking, a lot of people don't associate creativity with banking. But when we look at community banking, it really opens the field for doing all sorts of things in order to build value. And my subject with the CEO Affiliation Group was on capital planning. And we walked through all the elements of a capital plan and a question was raised from a banker that comes from a smaller asset size bank is how can I raise capital? And one of the bankers who was in the audience said we had a great idea. We were a de novo bank. We needed capital. So what we did is that we went out to all of our local universities in our franchise area and raised equity by doing preferred shares with those universities at a relatively high interest rate, but one that the bank thought was relatively cheap in terms of raising equity. So think about that, adding that to your contingency capital planning to look at what universities do you have in your area that have endowment funds. And when you even broaden that out, there might be other organizations that have endowment funds. That essentially you could go with your community involvement to these organizations and if you needed capital, in the instance of this particular banker, he was actually able to raise $20 million in preferred shares over a very short period of time through their local universities. Great idea. I immediately call the CEO of the bank where I'm the founding director of Embassy Bank and said, hey, this is a great idea. We should put this into our contingency capital raising and look at it as an idea for the future. So that you can put that in. The banker said that they actually listed out the universities and how much money they were able to get from each in their contingency capital plan. Once again, creative thinking. Creative thinking moves us forward. We had a situation at my bank that the CEO brought up that they were doing radio commercials for commercial loans. This is one area that most typically people don't do radio commercials for. In fact, as we sat around the board table, we were saying, how do I even get FM radio anymore? But interestingly enough, these radio commercials hit a nerve with local businesses and we have been receiving three or four calls asking for information coming from those particular commercials. Once again, creative thought process. That is something that is normally not done by other banks, but if you think out of the box, then you try different things, especially ones that have worked for other bankers is that those kind of idea exchanges, which they also do as part of the Sheshinoff CEO affiliation, is a wonderful way to learn different things that work and don't work. And we come back to thinking about, well, what can we do creative thought process-wise? Please come in with any ideas that you might have that we might be able to share on these webcasts in the future by emailing me at jbrew at seafreedbrew.com. Once again, have a great week, and it's Jay Brew, co-chairman of Seafreed and Brew.